So, I've been talking to this guy who thinks he's going to meet a 13-year-old boy for sex. And that kid is actually me. <laughs> it really is me. I use an old photo of myself from 2005, when I was 12 years old. But I told him that I'm almost 14. And he said, if you send a picture, I'll send one. And so I did. And he replied with two. He said, are you okay with a bigger guy? And I said, you know, sure, you're not that big. You look like you don't take any crap from anybody. He said, have you had any thoughts on how we're going to do this? We can meet somewhere close to you and go somewhere else. I said, that sounds good. I'd hate to run into someone I know. He said, I'm free Monday or Tuesday. So I replied, Tuesday will work better for me. Where are we going to meet, though? And that's when he wondered whereabouts I live, saying, is there a park or somewhere nearby that you can walk to? And when I asked him, where are you going to take me after we meet, where are you going to take me? He said, maybe back to my house or something like that. So I said, do you have loop? He said, yes. And then he said, how old do you think I am? I'm, I want you to really think about this. Look at this picture and think about how old this guy looks. Think about how old he would be. Because this shocked me, his answer. He said, I'm actually only just turned 16, unquote. <laughs> and I've seen this before. I know it's a lie. Just in case, in the back of a predator's mind, if this is a trap, the predator thinks that if I say, if I give an age that's so much closer to the minor's age, then if this is a sting operation, the person who's conducting this will probably not follow through and um, pursuing because there are bigger fish to catch, you know, say someone 30 and then 13 instead of 16 and 13. I've, I've seen this before. I know it's a lie. In chat, he had told me that he's six foot four and that he's larger. And other than the photo, which at this point, I don't know if it's him or not for sure. Other than that, I have nothing to go on. I have no vehicle description. So I have to dress up and act like a little boy because he's going to approach me, who he thinks to be a 13-year-old boy. He said, how long is it going to be? I said, I'll be there at 4 o'clock. I'll have a USA hat and sunglasses. And he requested more information. He wanted more. He said, what kind of clothes? So I said, red pants and a gray sweatshirt. I want to appear more youthful. Now, of course, I'll be wearing a hat and sunglasses to mask my aging, being that I'm 10 years older than he thinks. So I have to make sure that are key components that are out of the equation. Body hair. All of this. So, I'll be shaving. Oh, my height. My height. I'm six foot one. So I'm going to have to kind of uh, tone it down a little bit. Maybe by hunching. Or, um, I'm pretty lean. My muscle mass is very lean. Um, I have broad shoulders and stuff though, so maybe I can kind of, I don't know, go like this or something. And then um, I'm going to have to wear loose clothing, even though it'll make me look bigger, it won't make me look as tall. Um, so that's, that's, that's absolutely critical, is avoiding looking six foot one. There he is right there, six foot four. He just exited the solar vehicle to the right, Mercury. He's been sitting there for about 10 minutes, 7 to 10 minutes, 6 foot 4, he's approaching uh, from this frame, cooling near with a tree right there, huge fat guy. There he is. Hello? Hi? Hey! It's a nice park. Very nice. I didn't know if that was you. You've been <laughs> you're there for quite a while. <laughs> I've never really done this before, so that's I, I kind of st stood back by the bridge, far away. So how are you doing? Great. Is it, take a seat. Uh, I'm more of a standing person. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I've just been kind of lonely here. Just it's boring. Now. It's really boring. So your day was good. Yeah, mine too. How old are you? Actually, I'm 24. You're 24? You said you're 16. Yeah, What? Why did you say you're 16? Just in case the wrong eyes. 
Like who? <laughs> I don't know. So, where's your car? Cool. So we're gonna go. If this this is just the meeting place, right? Where are we gonna go after this? Oh. <laughs> I should shake your hand or fist pump. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't it? It's official. All right. So. I know I said I was 5'6. I'm actually a little tall. I just measured myself 5'9. So. But cool. Yeah. So, what was your name? Nick. Nick? Okay, I'm Zach. <laughs> yeah. I have OCD, so I don't really shake hands. But, uh, like Holly Mandel, you've seen that guy? Yeah, you know, I've, I've, my parents don't know I'm gay yet. <laughs> so, I don't know, like, your coming out story, but I don't know how to put it to them. You know? I'm not out. Oh, you aren't? Not yet? Oh. I mean, <laughs> we share a lot of things in common, though, but when you said you were 16, though, I thought, like, oh, dang, you're, but, you know, 24, it's, well, I'm 13, 20, almost 14, but I don't really know, but sunglasses just got this weird, it's like they're huge and big and bulky, but, do you have any eye protection, but not on a day like this, not really sunny, but, uh, I do at home, yeah, oh, cool. Do you have any condom? Pr no, just kidding. <laughs> We're not like that. <laughs> can't get guys can't get pregnant. That's a good thing, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, is this this car? Cool. Oh shoot. Any marijuana in here? You have marijuana in here? Oh jeez, I was just joking. Jeez. What else? Oh my God. What? I don't know if I want to get in there. No, just get out. Oh shoot, it's dirty. You weren't kidding. Where are, we, where are we gonna go though? I just, I have to know. I don't know, we can walk in the woods or something, I don't know. Like, to do what? Is it, like, what were you thinking, just like, full like anal, or, I've never done anal, but. I mean, it's up to you. Oh, I don't, Whatever. I don't know. Like, oral, is, is that just to start? Yeah, I don't want to be pushy or. Anything. Oh, okay. I, I, have, I really like that. And I did some research though, the age of consent. It's like 16, I'm only 13. Yeah. So shoot. You know that too? Yeah. Shoot. But yeah, but we won't get caught though. Right? No. So that's good. But dang, where's the marijuana? I gotta see it. I've never seen it before. No. no. Oh, there's a spider in there. Shoot. See the spider? What is that? Do you have any cockroaches in here or bed bugs or anything? No. You sure? Yeah. Jeez, what's up? How'd you, how'd you get it so dirty? I just bought it. What? It was like this then? Oh, yeah, really? I haven't cleaned it yet. Someone. Someone sold it like this? What? I thought you got a really good deal on it then, right? Yeah, really good deal. Cool. And it runs perfectly. You good? It was like, I literally had bought it like two or three days ago. What? Yeah. And it really? runs great. How so much did it cost? I only paid like $1,200 for it. 12, oh my god, you did a really good deal. Yeah. Shoot. That's a good deal. This is a lot of money though for a 13 year old. I can't, I can't afford crap, really. So. Yeah. yeah. I mean, but I was like, when I have time, when I'm not working, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll clean it and stuff like that. Yeah. You know, make it look nice. Yeah. So we're not, where are we, so we're not going in the woods, clearly, so. I mean, if you want to. Well, where are you going to take me, though? I want to know. Like, is it your house or something? Like, well, I, I can't go too far from home is why. Oh. No, cause, I see. Yeah. I see, I see. Yeah. So, like, where's your house, though? Grand Rapids, you said? Yeah, but more towards like Cascade. Oh shoot, the yeah. rich area. Yeah. Well, sure, we can go there, I guess. I went to Forest Hills. Forest Hills? Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I'm going to Kenwa Hills. Yeah. All right. Well, yeah, that's okay. No well, problem. You my mind. my dad might be home. You dad? What? Are you serious? Yeah. Shoot. Oh. Yeah, but how? Well, you can like call him, right? See if he's there. Or... Yeah, but that might sound weird. No, just just tell him that. Like, oh shoot, what can you say? I don't know. That's cool. It's like a real clock right there. It's like not digital. Mm -hmm. Wow. I don't. I can't read those very well. Like that. Like I don't even know what time it is from there. <laughs> I've never really did good at that. Four sixteen. Oh shoot, four sixteen. Okay. So your dad might be home. Shoot. Yeah, he wasn't when I left, but 
So, like, you bought this car and there's marijuana in it? No, <laughs> marijuana is mine. Oh, what? How much do you have? Like, a ton of it? Not like that much. No. Oh. <laughs> Just wondering. Dang, whoever had owned this last is really dirty as shit. It's insane. Yeah, like all this is just, it bothers me. Yeah, I don't see any bed bugs, so that's good. No. I was in this other guy's house a long time. My friend, old friend, his house was like terrible. It was his, it was his parents' house, but it was really gross. Mm -hmm. But uh, the kitchen was really messy and stuff. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah. So what do you do? Look at the dog behind us. Look, see the dog in the back? A little chihuahua. I love dogs. You have any dogs? Mm -hmm. Oh shoot. I like the sunroof. Wow. So let's. So your dad might be home. You didn't. You should plan. I plan this. What the heck? Yeah, his his schedule is very um, mixed because he's retired now. Oh okay. Yeah. Um. So what do we, we just? I mean, the AC is not alright. <laughs> just like you're just thinking. I'm just thinking, yeah. Okay. Because <coughs> well, I want to go home, him be there, and then, like, he sees me, and then we have That would leave, stink. And then and just... Well, let's take a little drive. No, I just, I don't know. What the heck? Where, though? I don't know. Well, there are woods over there. Want to go over there? Sure. Okay, let's go. Yeah, you don't want to, don't want to go to your dad's house if you stay here. Right? Shoot. Yeah, let's get on. that. Another thing I have to fix is the handle on the inside. Oh, it's broken, so you gotta use one on the outside. Oh, I can't use this? No. Oh, the that's cable, good to know. I'm gonna I, gotta, set that. I gotta take the door panel off. And... Really? It's true. That's insane. So, like, I couldn't have gotten out of here? Like, I'd, you'd have to roll the windows down? Well, it's like, it's a trap! It's a trap! Admiral Akbar! No, just kidding. I'm not worried about that. I've known you long enough. No. Just kidding. Have you ever been here before? Mm -hmm. Oh, I, I come here like all the time. When I was a kid, yeah. <laughs> I'm still a kid. Look at when you arrived. Look at the dog. Everyone here has a dog. Where are all the bicycles, though? I don't have a dog yet. Oh. Yeah, you know, I'm surprised about how warm it is. Today. Yeah. Michigan is yeah. so weird with the weather. I know, right? Like I in early. It's supposed to get snow this week. Oh, yeah. Um, like tomorrow or the day after, it's supposed to be a snowstorm. Yeah. Like, what is it? March? What's March? What is it? It's the end of March. It's March. 22? Shoot. March 22. Yeah, 22. Yep. Yeah. Um, dang, that's insane. March 22. And I know snow. Jeez, in early March, March 5th, it was snowing like crazy. I was in the cemetery just walking around. And, uh, there was so much of snow on my hair. It's just... Within like 22 minutes, just snow everywhere. My eyelashes. Look how well it blends in, the little dog. <laughs> yeah. Uh, just oral. You have like lube though, like like anal. Is that does lube need to be required every time, or like I don't know how that works because you know I'm not experienced. Yeah. I'm a virgin. So. I would. I would yeah. definitely recommend it any time. Okay. Yeah. Is it like, what is it made out? Is it like whipped cream or like what? No, it's like, um, sometimes it's made out of like, it's like water based. Okay, so it's like water, water based. Mm -hmm. Like what's that mean? Like water and oil. Like oh, okay. Not, not like oil, oil, WD-40? <laughs> no, not oh. Flammable. <laughs> flammable and harmful to your skin. Shoot. It's made with like natural ingredients that aren't oh. harmful to your body. Good. Good thing, you're really tall. Yeah? Yeah. Six foot five. Six foot, oh my gee. That's crazy. Dang, look how high up we are. Oh my gosh. You play the uh, Yeah. Are you? No. Yeah. Well, well, not like right here because like, you know, it's not like you fall and you die. You fall and you might roll a few feet, but we're like, what? From the park and that was like 50 feet up. No, maybe not that much. Dang, look how big that hill is. I love geology. I studied it extensively. I was actually recommended by my professor, I mean teacher, to be uh, to, to tutor other students in it, because I was that good. 
That was like me back in the day. Back in the day? It was not with geology, but with like biology and stuff. Like biology? That. Cool. I took AP biology senior year of high school. I did pretty well in it, um, passed the AP exam. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Dude, you knew I was 13 and you still wanted to do this? Well, I don't want to push anything. You don't want to push anything? Yeah. But it's okay if a 13-year-old agrees to it. Well, yes no. Why? I mean, the law would say no. The law would say no. You know why, right? Because it's right. That's right. Because minors should not make these types of choices due to being naive. The law is there to protect them. And I have to tell you, that person in the photo was me in 2005. Yeah. It's 2016 now. What do you have to say for yourself? You marijuana in the car. Why are you laughing? You're Nothing. smiling. You can take a seat if you want. If it's, if it's too much, I don't want you falling, okay? No, I like to stand. That's good. It's just sick. 13. 13. 24. I'm only here to offer advice if you need it. Advice? You said you'd be willing to have oral sex here. And have lube? Oh, dude, that's just terrible. It's terrible. I can't believe it. 13. 13 years old. I'm, I'm 23. I'm, tw I'm 23, dude. That's, I'm not 13. No, you're not. Yeah. I knew that from the very beginning. Yeah, but you, you still, and you still wanted to say that, yeah, let's have oral sex out here? No. Well, then why'd you bring me out here? Because I thought you wanted to walk. What? Oh, dude, give me a break. You, you thought I was 13, you wanted to have sex with me. No. You wanted to deny it? Okay. Good luck. It's messed up, dude. It's messed up. Okay, you're being filmed right now, okay? You're being filmed. Everything. Okay, I know who you are. Don't do anything stupid. Okay? Absolutely disgusting. All right, and all that trash in your car, that's from you, okay? That's from you. That, you didn't buy that car a few days. You kept on lying to me. You t why did you say you were 16? Right, because you wanted to be more like a 13-year-old. You wanted it to be less creepy. No. Why? Then, then why did you say you were 16? Because. Because? I think there's a void in that response somewhere that I didn't hear. Because why? Why did you say, I'm 16? Because it's only three years difference from 13, not 11. Is this a staring contest? What do you have to say? I don't know. Okay. It's absolutely disgusting. I wasn't going to do anything. Yeah? Yeah. You were prepared to do everything? No, I'm not. With a 13-year-old boy? No, I'm not. <laughs> okay. I'm not prepared to do anything. Okay, and yet you brought who you thought to be a 13-year-old boy in the woods for sex. I didn't bring you up here for sex. Okay, just, just a walk, right? Just a walk after saying we could do oral, if you'd like. I never said I wanted to. Okay. You're the one that said that, not me. You said, you said, I said, hey, you know, Anal, you said I'm not going to push you to do anything. Is it okay if we can do oral? Yeah, if you want to. I didn't say that. I said okay. I'm not going to push you to do anything because I'm not that kind of person. All right, but, but if the kid agreed to it, no. you would have. No. As you just told me the age of consent. 16. That's right. If you were I'm 13. 13. You, you would not be able to consent for yourself. But, but you just said, you just told me that, yeah, I know you're 13. Yes, I know the legal age of consent in the car. And then you brought me out here anyway. And dude, you are sweating, man. If, you, if you'd like to take a seat, just take a seat, okay? No. Or you can just go, okay? Yeah, I don't know. I know this is a lot to take, okay? I know you're lying to me. About what? About everything we just discussed. About how you thought, like what? You thought like I was an older person? But, and then I, yet you acknowledged I, that I'm 13? I, well, I, I, knew, I knew from the very beginning. <laughs> you, what? You, you thought that it was some dude pretending to be 13? And you followed through with it anyway? Because I know... I know you, so, I because, because you knew I was 23? I didn't know you were 23, but I knew you were over 18 just by the way you talked. How? You can't back up any of this? I've, t I've taken a lot of classes. Where? On reading people. On, on reading people? Psychology. Okay, um, what credentials do you have? Where? Credentials? I don't need them. Yeah, what? I've no, what? You've taken classes where? Community college. I've taken them at a Okay, who are your professors at GRCC? It doesn't matter. 
It doesn't matter because you can't name any professors there. I went there. I know it. I know the whole place, like the back of my hand. Yeah. You can, you know, you can tell me the, the class codes and the numbers, the professors, where it's located, which buildings. I know all of that. Yeah. And you, you, you do. The music department? Mu yeah, I know. I, yep, I'm, I'm, I'm aware of that building. It's the oldest building at GRCC. Mm -hmm. Yep, 1920s. Mm -hmm. But how, how did we go from psychology to music? You, you took music classes there instead of psychology classes? You did not take any psychology classes. Yeah, I didn't. So you thought that a 13-year-old boy, hey, I'm 13, and then you still went through with it? Why? How come you didn't say, dude, I can't do this. I'm going to leave you alone. Why? Actually, I did. No, you didn't. Yeah. What did you say? What did you say? I asked you your age. You said 13. Da, 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 13, da, yep. Da. Okay. You didn't answer my question. What was your question? My question was, wh why did you just continue with it? Why? You, I don't. I don't understand your your point here. It's because I knew you were not thirteen. Obviously. And when did you indicate that? When? Um, this whole time. When? After the third or fourth message. Dude, no, you didn't. No, I have the chat. I have everything. You never said that. Um, you're only saying this because. I'm confronting you and I'm 23, I'm not 13. That's the only reason why you're saying this. The only reason why you're telling me that, oh, I was just playing along, is because you got caught. That's the only reason why. The only, absolute only reason why is because you got caught. You'd have still had sex with me. It's just ridiculous. From the very beginning, it doesn't even matter you coming here. From the very beginning, you knew I was 13 and you wanted to have sex. You agreed to have sex. The age of consent is there even though if the persona agrees with it, the ages of consent is there to protect people. It's the law saying, look, this is the age where we feel that people should have the right to decide for themselves. Because a lot of times, younger people, they say, okay, yeah, they do stuff like this sometimes. According to the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, they're curious about sex. And they, when given the opportunity, they might indulge. They, you know, they... This, this happens all the time until later in life people regret it these people these victims kids grow up and think you know what that was wrong I was so young I was so naive I was so stupid adults are responsible adults they know the law they understand they're expected by society not to do this okay and it just makes me sick that after all of this he wanted to do this it's absolutely disgusting what would your dad think about this A ghost of your past. Yes. Can you elaborate on that? Meaning that when I was probably about ten, okay, I had a similar situation happen to me. Where someone abused you. Yes. Okay, that happens a lot for people, dude. If that is, if you're telling me the truth, break the cycle, break the cycle. Okay. I mean, I understand statistically, people like that are more likely to do it to other people. Um, victims growing up and you know just you have to you have to stop okay you have to you have to. great I appreciate you telling me that okay but seriously dude if that's if that's the truth break the cycle don't let it happen to anyone else okay all right mister take it easy be be easy going on the way down okay you know I'm gonna leave you alone all right I'll walk a different way. All right? And clean that car too, dude. All right? Yeah, awesome. All right, take it easy, brother. Thank you, mister. Yep. I helped you. All right, it's, it's good to hear that. Yep. I really appreciate it. Okay? Thank you.